He has all the makings of a Hollywood movie. A high school teacher and his students start a multi-million dollar drug ring that spans coast to coast. Well, it did actually happen in Coronado, and now George Clooney may want to take the story to the big screen. NBC7's Johnny Bacchus is in Coronado tonight. She joins us to tell us about uh, this high star power behind the potential project, Anya. Yeah, hi, Catherine. Definitely high star power. And you know what? It all goes uh, with a storyline that kind of goes a little something like this. Back in the 70s, a Coronado High School teacher actually acted as a translator for some of his students during a marijuana drug deal in Tijuana that actually turned them into drug lords. But when you ask people around here about that, they don't really like to talk about it. The charming, quiet city of Coronado, it's not something too many people know about. I've heard it before, but I don't know the details. Uh, no, I haven't. We've only lived here about six uh, years or so. And if they do, they're not talking. To find out, you have to dig deep into the Coronado Library archives. And even there, you might find a little blurb. But to really know... You know it's like the Coronado's dirty little secret. And uh, some other major You've players... You've got to talk to this yeah, man, really Joe Dittler, man. who's considered the city story. It's far from a good, clean American novel. It's about a bunch of kids taking shortcuts and uh, getting caught. Maybe a problem He knows for the him. real story behind the Coronado Company, a multi-million dollar marijuana smuggling ring started by a former Coronado High School teacher and his students. For 10 oh, years, yeah. he's been working on a book about it. Now it's rumored to be the storyline of a movie George Clooney is interested in. More than these kids and more than the fact that it was a school teacher that led them through this, I think it's the fact that Coronado was involved. And though no one really wants to talk about it, if anyone could air Coronado's secrets, they say it would be Clooney. I just got excited when I saw his name and Coronado in the same sentence. I just want to tell Mr. Clooney, look, uh, you're going to do this movie. I think you probably ought to give us a call and talk to us about it. You know? Yeah, and you know what, he's probably right because anyone we reached out to about this story in the city of Coronado said you need to talk to Joe. Uh, even the executive director of Coronado's Historical Association told us they had no records of this actually happening. And he actually said he felt like the media was blowing it a little out of proportion. Uh, right now, this is just rumors. We have not been able to confirm if Clooney's actually going to take on the project. Reporting live from Coronado, Don Ubacchus, NBC7. All right, Tanya, thanks very much.